Hey guys, it's me Lane, and today I'm going to be reading all of my lotions. Yeah, that's all I could think of. For now, I don't have that many lotions, so yeah. Oh, plus body creams. Don't, don't want to forget that. <laughs> so obviously, as you can tell, I sort of have a background going here. Um, not the biggest change, but yeah, this is just temporary. Oh my gosh, I can never say the word. Temporarily. Yeah. It's gonna be here temporarily. Um, I just haven't decorated my room for fall yet. I also hopefully plan on doing a DIY fall decor video. Kind of that last year. I've been coming up with new ideas and stuff. And yeah. I also really, really, really want to do a fall lookbook. I think that'll be something new that I've never done before, so yeah. All of my social media will be down in the description below, as well as any other information that you might want to read about. Yeah, I usually read something down there. And from that, let's get on to the video. First solution I have here is Oil Moisturizer by Panama Jack. It's olive oil, hemp seed oil, and vitamin E. Um, well yeah, it has aloe and cocoa butter and it's originally scent that's cool i haven't really used that this much you might be like what probably only use this once actually though it's old <laughs> also i definitely would recommend using this lotion over the summer because it has aloe in it which actually from like helps kind of heal your sunburn it smells pretty good i would actually rate this Probably 9 out of 10, not even joking. It's, it smells amazing, first off. It is actually really good for your skin, and I just overall like how it's set up. The next one we have is more of a winter one. It's Winter Candy Apple Body Lotion from Bath & Body Works. I think that, like, packaging or whatever, I'm going to call the outside packaging, is really cute. I love how it shines and stuff. It smells really good. I mean, it's not my favorite scent. It's more of just like that lotion -y scent, but otherwise it smells pretty good. I would rate this 7.5. Yeah. Next one we have is Honolulu Sun. This one's actually new. <laughs> this one's actually new. I got this in July. I used to have a hand sanitizer for this. It's from Bath & Body Works as Shia and Vitamin E. It smells really, really good, and I love the backpack sheen, I don't know why, it's just really, it's like a matte smooth, which I really like, and overall, I just love the vibe it gets off. The next one we have is Cashmere Glow, as Shia and Vitamin E in it, and from Bath & Body Works. It's like a honey sort of thing going on. I'm not the biggest fan of the pack sheen, I think just, I don't know. Actually, when I first got this, I thought that was corn. <laughs> I don't know why. It doesn't smell the best. It, I don't know, it has a funky smell. When you first smell it, it's like, okay, yeah, that's pretty good. But for some reason, like, after a couple seconds, it gives this stingy sort of feeling off into your nose, if that makes sense. Oh, wait, did I read? Okay, no, I would rate this. I'm sorry, I would only rate this probably like a 4.5. Don't know if I use this that much. And the next one we have, oh, this one is my absolute favorite. Maui by Bath & Body Works, Hippocus Beach, as Shia and Vitamin E in it. That's what a lot of them seem to have. It's kind of like Honolulu Sun, but not at the same time. It has like that really nice summer vibe off. It's just, this one, Maui smells so, so good. I would rate this 10 out of 10. Love it. I don't know if they have it out on sale anymore, and I'm really mad that it's starting to run out, but it smells amazing, guys. Hey, um, the next one we have is Secret Wonderland Body Lotion. It has vitamin E, Jujaba. Oh, it's actually a signature collection. It has like these kind of things on the side that feels nice. I'm not the biggest fan of the colors, but it, it gives off that mystical vibe, if that makes any sense. 
Oh, duh, it's called Secret Wonderland. It is so dumb. I don't know. I'm not the biggest fan of this. Gives a stingy feeling off to my throat, kind of like the this one did, except in my nose. Um, I don't know. It doesn't smell that bad, but I would only rate it like maybe a seven. The next one we have is Wild Honeysuckle Body Lotion. It's vitamin E, Jojaba, and Shea Butter. It's also a signature collection by Bath and Body Works. I love the vibe this gives out. It, I just. I don't know, I'm into these type of colors. This actually smells really good. Um, yeah, I like it. It gives you that, like, feel at home kind of vibe, actually. That is pretty good. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like if you wear a certain type of lotion or just in time of scent around the room, like, it, I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> like, candles, for example. What the heck? Oh. Like, candles if you like them. It gives you that type of vibe. Oh yeah, that's what it's called. It gives you Put this on, it gives you a nice summer vibe and you just wanna wear this outside and hang out with your friends and stuff. This one, just like, really relaxing, makes you wanna stay home. This one makes you maybe wanna just drink hot cocoa by the fire fate. Fire police. I'm kinda getting the point. Okay, um, this next one, I kind of took the, um, packaging off. I do remember what the packaging looked like. Um, this one I got when I was seven years old, and I'm surprised there's still any lotion in here. This one, okay, because my friend did this. Wait, hold up. This was, it was, oh, now I know, because I knew it was a Christmas sort of type thing, because... Yeah, okay. Sugar Plum. This was what it was. Sugar Plum Fairy or something like that. Packaging right now, I'm not the biggest fan of. Packaging back then, yeah, it was actually pretty cute. I can't even smell it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> mm -mm. Nope. Nope. Two out of ten. Holy. <laughs> okay, now I'm just over exaggerating, but I don't know. It did not smell good at all. So, you have this one, which I've also had since I was, actually, you know what, I think I had this before I was even, no. Oh, no, I got this a little bit after I got the disgusting plum one. It's by the Sweethearts, something that's not by Bath and Body Works. I don't know what that was from, but yeah. Um, it's Honey Sweetheart as Shame Rich. Packaging, I really do like. Um... It's like, okay, it's not exactly my style. If this was gone, that would be really cute. Maybe have, like, the Eiffel Tower or something. I don't know. Something rose gold. But hey, that's just my opinion. This one smells really good. It reminds me of when I was a child. I don't know why. I don't know. It smells super good. Wow. This is probably one of my second favorites, actually. No, actually, it's my third favorite. But yeah, I really do like this. I would rate this an 8 out of 10. It's really great. Probably don't sell these anymore, though. It's finally empty. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and hey, maybe even hit that notification button. Sorry I don't really post that much, as I used to. I'm trying to get into the habit of posting more often. So, yeah. I hope you guys have a great day. Yeah, I'm not gonna have these outros or intros. <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna go. Bye.